Welcome to Mastering Brushes in Illustrator. My name is Cheryl Graham, and in this course, we'll go into Illustrator's brushes in depth and see how they can be used to create painterly illustrations that look like natural media. Now, when you think about digital painting, Illustrator might not immediately come to mind. Many digital artists use Photoshop, Corel Painter, and Sketchbook, things like that, but Illustrator has some distinct advantages over those applications. The greatest advantage is that Illustrator is object-based rather than pixel-based. The vector objects in Illustrator can be styled with an infinite variety of brushes and appearances, while the underlying structure remains the same. Objects can be scaled, moved, rotated, rearranged, duplicated, and deleted with no loss of quality whatsoever. In this course, you'll learn how to get the most out of the brush tool and how to adjust its options to suit your workflow. We'll learn all about the five kinds of brushes in Illustrator and how to create and modify your own custom brushes. We'll look at a few other tools that aren't technically brushes, but can be used to achieve painterly results as well, either on their own or in combination with the brushes. Finally, we'll put it all together and create a couple of vector paintings. At the end of this course, I hope you'll feel a greater confidence and understanding when using these powerful tools and be inspired to take your vectors into the realm of natural media painting. So let's get started. 